Hello and welcome to Point of View. Today, we're witnessing a significant milestone in the field of space exploration. The Einstein Probe, a mission of the Chinese Academy of Sciences, in collaboration with the European Space Agency and the Max Planck Institute for Extraterrestrial Physics in Germany, has just lifted off. The Einstein Probe is a significant space mission that is dedicated to time-domain high-energy astrophysics. Its primary goals are to discover high-energy transients and monitor variable objects. The Einstein Probe carries two scientific X-ray telescopes. The Wide Field X-ray Telescope WXD and the follow-up X-ray Telescope FXD are the two main instruments on board. The WXD uses a novel type of optics, inspired by the eyes of lobsters, which allows for a large field of view. This sets the mission apart from ESA's other missions Exorism and Athena, which have a higher spectral and spatial resolution, but a limited field of view. The Einstein probe was launched using the Long March 2C rocket. The Long March 2C is a two-stage medium lift launch vehicle, developed by the China Academy of Launch Vehicle Technology. It can carry up to 3,850 kg to low Earth orbit and can use a number of upper stages for missions to sun-synchronous orbit. The rocket is 43 meters long and 3.35 meters wide, and has a liftoff weight of 242.5 metric tons. It has launched more than 50 times since its debut in 1982. The Einstein probe mission and China's broader space exploration ambitions represent a significant contribution to our understanding of the universe. They also highlight China's growing capabilities in space technology and exploration. The successful launch of the Einstein probe is a testament to the progress made by China in space exploration and its commitment to contributing to global scientific knowledge. This mission is a testament to China's ambitious space exploration plans. China's space exploration ambitions are grand and far-reaching. In the next five years, China plans to launch a robotic craft to an asteroid, build a space telescope to rival the Hubble, and lay the foundations for a space-based gravitational wave detector. China also plans to send humans to the moon by 2030 and build a permanent research station by 2036 on the lunar south pole. That's a wrap. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.